What is up everybody? Welcome to Gistic Tutorials. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to create a text input using HTML. So first of all, you want to open up your text editor. I'm using um, Visual Studio Code um, and you want to create a new file and name it uh, index.html or whatever. Just make sure it's a HTML file. So it's important you include the .html. So then um, I'm going to go ahead and create the markup for a regular HTML web page visual studio code allows you to just hold shift and press the exclamation mark then enter to create this if not um i'll leave this in the description so you can copy and paste it if you would like to create the text input what you guys want to do is first of all create a form so you can do that by doing that you don't need the form action at the moment because this is only html and then inside that form what you guys want to do is create a label. We're going to name it F name. So this will be the first name. And then inside the label, just um, type in first name or whatever you want um, appearing above the text input. So that's what it's going to look like. And then I'm going to include a break. And then I'm going to type input. And then under type, I'm going to put text and then I'm going to ID it as F name, the same as the label. And then I'm going to include a placeholder and that placeholder is going to be type here, uh, triple dot. And then I'm going to go ahead and save it by pressing control S going to my browser where I'm going to refresh the, the local host. And as you can see, there is a text input here with the first name above it. So if I go control shift I, and then if I go control shift C, you guys can see that the first name is the label um, F name. And the text input is right underneath it with the placeholder being type here. So in this video, I'm not going to show you how to style it or anything because that is not what this video is about. But I will show you how to create a simple form real quickly. But that is how you create a text input. So if you want to create another field, you can just go ahead and um, usually put a break in between just so there's some space. And then I'm going to put uh, last name. And then we're going to say L name and then type here. So this is actually going to be within a field set. So I'm going to go ahead and copy that and close it at the end of this. So just do that. I'm just going to double space this actually. Just so that looks a little bit neater. And then we're going to put a legend, which is just a name at the top of the form pretty much. So I'm just going to name it form and close that right after. And at the very bottom, we're going to enter, um, uh, we're going to put another two breaks and then we're going to put, um, Another input type, this time we're going to put the type of submit to make a submit button. And we're going to value that as submit. So inside the submit button, it will say submit. And then we're going to save that again and reload the page. And as you can see, we have created a simple form with a submit button. So I hope this video helped you guys. If it did, please smash that like button. And if you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button as well. Um, if you guys want more web developing tutorials, let me know down in the comments. And yeah, that is it from me, everybody. Have a wonderful day and peace out.